What's going on guys? Today is Sunday afternoon. Today is back day. My goal today was to record my whole back workout, but that didn't happen because my man didn't show up. So I couldn't really record my whole workout, so I had to do what I could do. So today I just decided to just, you know, um, record my deadlift workout. So today I am working with 335. This is the new PR. You know, my goal is for all my compounds is to be adding consistent weight to the bar each week or each session. You know, so if I'm aiming for a certain number of reps, I once I hit those reps on all all sets, I add at least five pounds, so a minimum of two point five up to five pounds. I feel like that's the best way to progress each week. If you're not adding weight to the bar, you should be doing more reps. If you're not doing more reps, then you're wasting your time. Here's my second set here, really focusing on my form. Uh, let me know the, how the quality of this video is. You know, the gym was pretty packed, so I couldn't get my normal deadlift spot. So I had to be up front where the windows are. So if it's a little blurry, I apologize. Uh, also, you know, this dude, man, I don't, he was just in the way. He just kept walking back and forth, bullshitting. He wasn't really doing anything. But here, 315, not 315, 335 went up real easy. My mind-muscle connection with my back is really improving. I can really, I'm starting to feel my back contracting. I can really feel the stretch at the top as well as the bottom. I can control the weight more. Also, what really helped me with my deadlifts is keeping the bar close to my shins. Even though I run the risk of scraping, but, you know, the fastest way between point A and point B is a straight line. Also, for my dead, for deadlifts, man, don't don't rush it. After you do, you know, one rep, bring it down, reset. Don't just keep going up and down with it. I, I used to make that mistake, and I used to fuck my form up. So I like to really focus on, once I bring the bar back down to the floor, take a break. They take a second, reset, get my form right, and then proceed to the next rep. Also, I have hit over 100 subscribers. I want to thank y'all for the support. And really liking my videos and commenting and really interacting with me means a lot. My channel has grown pretty quickly, honestly. And, you know, there's going to be more to come. Eventually, I'm going to invest in a camera and a laptop so I can do more editing work. You know, I'm editing on my, uh, on my iFi, uh, iPhone, iPhone 5S. I got the little iMovie app, which is only limits me to what I can do. Also, recently, I've been thinking about getting into competing. I don't know if I want to do bodybuilding or physique, but one of those, I was supposed to go to a show yesterday, and I've seen some of the guys from our gym that are going, and it's like really motivating me to really compete, so look for that in the near future. Also, I want to do powerlifting as well. I feel like my strength is growing really quickly, and I feel like that'll be a great path for me really actually to get my name out there you know i feel like if i compete or do some type of show that'll help get my name and my brand out there and i'll really help get grow my channel even more but uh, yeah so this is my workout for today sorry i couldn't get everything that i did but you know like again i was unlimited but if you guys like this video please subscribe hit the like button share let me know what you guys want to see um i'm gonna see if i can get another video out tomorrow who knows Follow me on my Instagram if you guys haven't already, and I'll see you guys next time.